Shall we begin? Let's begin now. As promised, I'm back with the Tamiya Barricade set. Now, I've put these together from the set, which I'm not impressed at all. So, I mean, I went out into the garden and I cut a few twigs off the wife's shrubs and I think that's better than that any day. But I can't see, me personally, I can't see the use of them. Uh, I've sort of, I can't find any reference to where they're used and how they're used. So, me, no, I'm not, I wouldn't use them for anything to be quite sure. Uh, the other things were the anti-tank obstacles. Uh, I've only just given these one coat of like well actually it's, it's uh, rush track but uh, just to see what they like I'm not happy I don't like them I'm not happy with them uh, I did do some checking around and they weren't really sort of put together like this but they're going to be recycled I'm I'll take take them apart and I think I'm just going to use some bits of uh, plate and uh, try and make them look a bit more authentic. All right. uh, because I was going to do all that is on a diorama now I've done this one because I've been playing about with my barbed wire and I was trying to get my barbed wire done. Well this is, these are bits out of the Tamiya uh, barricade set just these posts which uh, I, I don't think they come out too bad I still need to do a bit of playing around if I put some up behind the bank there that's better you can see so no I wouldn't buy the kit again definitely wouldn't buy the kit again everything in that kit I mean I am a novice I am a total novice uh, to the modeling but I felt quite comfortable going out there getting bits of bits of wood and actually making them and I, I really think if you can make why buy and why should you buy something that you know you can make twice as good as what uh, they're charging you five, six pound for. So really the Tamiya one I wouldn't buy. Uh, to me it's bin fodder. It's, uh, I mean, it depends, I mean if you live on the moon and you, you ain't got no access to sticks and bits and pieces like that, well fair enough, you buy it. But me personally, I wouldn't buy it again. But saying that, I've just put out a, a video for the uh, inter interlary. Inter, I said that right. I hope interlary one. Their barricade set. Now they've got some interesting bits in there. They're showing you uh, some different things. So I'm gonna put all that together as well and see what they come out like and I'll do another little video because this is all experimenting for me you see because I am a real novice uh, modeler like I say I've, I've, I've been at it for four, out of it for 43 years uh, and uh, it, I've only been I've only started about a year and a half ago and uh, everything is so new and I just want to I just enjoy practicing and making things so like I say this is just I'm playing at the moment uh, so when I do actually come to you know doing something doing these dioramas 
that I've got a little bit of uh, know-how behind me before I get there. But that's my barbed wire so far. Uh, if you're interested, I can do a small video on it, but I'm still playing, trying to get it. I don't, I don't know. Uh, a little bit better. Uh, I've got the barbs down to nice, nice small ones, so it looks more realistic. But I still think I could. There's a little bit of room for improvement there. But like I say, if you are interested stick it in a comment below and I will do it well I'll, I'll probably I'll probably will do it anyway just to show you how I'm how I do uh, the barbed wire and uh, if it helps anybody well it helps right okay thank you very much and uh, I'll see you on the other side